Hey guys, what's up? It's me, the Dominus Ignis, and in today's NHRL challenge, yeah, it's the very first proper NHRL challenge, I got challenged by the PAX creator to take Lynx, that brilliant egg beater that was alleged to, that rip, that if you remember World Championship 7, it was alleged that Riptide had actually taken a few notes from Lynx. I'm not here to say Riptide did or didn't do that, but you might remember that. Well, I'm going to try and take on every champion in the pack with links now at the bare minimum that's gonna be every battle boss champion but if i can get it working from an older version i'm also gonna send links off to take on the robot wars champions apollo carbide and eruption this should be a lot of fun let's do this all right here we go first opponent we're taking on by force now the thing about the nhrl pack is the robots are really powerful compared to like the battle bots replicas so we have a good chance but of course as we learned when fighting robots like glitch there are some that could really give us troubles even with the nhrl replicas right now we're having a ground clearance battle here with uh by force oh gosh oh gosh okay actually being upside down might be useful hold on oh god not if we get hit from the sides though okay it's fine it's fine oh we got him we got him we got him we got him okay my hope is that I can hit, like, the, uh, bit that holds the weapon. But if not, then, you know, destroying the wedgelets is a good start. Oh, bounce back. And we're getting back in for more. Our weapon's getting destroyed. That's a bad sign. But we're also destroying theirs. That's a good... Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. Okay. That's it. Gotta keep on them. Okay. All right. All right. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god, this is a hard-hitting bout. Okay. And look at that. Oh my god. And we ripped their weapon out. Yes! And we got them stuck. Oh my god. There we go. That was crazy. Like, so much happened there. Look at all the shrapnel. Oh my god. I Well, there we go. We got our first point. All right, this is going to be another tough one. We're going to be taking on Tombstone now. And Tombstone has, like, a, one of those really tough weapons to take out. But if we get the wheels, like, we just took out half already, then we absolutely can win this. Oh, or if we do that. <laughs> oh, my God. And they've windmilled. Okay, that's that, then. Like, there's no way for them to get free because there's nothing for them to, like, do. Well, that's our second point already. We made quick work of that with the legs there. Good lord. All right, well, let's move on. All right, we're going to take on Endgame next. And we got the spinner up to speed. Oh, got to be careful. Got to be careful. And, oh, my God. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, okay, okay. Endgame, we should be able to destroy their weapon like we okay, like we are doing. Man, I am This is like reverse jinxing. The moment I say something good happening, it happens in this episode, apparently. Oh, and oh, Endgame wants to keep going, huh? Okay, that's fine. It's your funeral, Endgame. Oh, look at that! Oh, how are those forks helping you, Endgame? Oh my god, the NHRL pack is crazy. It's balanced, obviously, for itself, but it means that, like, the BattleBots robots, nine times out of ten, they get absolutely bodied by Lynx. Oh. And that's Endgame dealt with. Right, we're moving on. All right, it's time to deal with Tantrum. Here we go. Okay, so Tantrum's weapon isn't what I'm worried about. It's the fact that Tantrum is quite low to the ground. Because we should be able to take that weapon out quite easily. It's just a case of getting underneath Tantrum is a bit of an issue. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got them. We got them. All right. That's a good sign. There we go. All right, we got to keep on them like this. There we go. That's one fork gone. That's their weapon gone. That's a good sign. And... Oh! Look at the powerful shots we've given, Tantrum. 
Okay. Our weapon, I think, is slightly unbalanced. Not that it matters. Okay. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. Okay. I am... Back on my feet. There we go. Oh my god. Whoa. Gotta be careful about this. Oh, Tantrum. You really don't want to keep doing this. Oh my god. Okay, we just gouged out one of their wheels. And they're done. Look at that. We are undefeated so far. All right, time to take on the latest champion, Sawblaze. Which uh, I am nervous about because Sawblaze's weapon is pretty powerful in this. So, um, yeah, I don't know how this is good. Oh, my weapon is breaking. Oh, that's what I was worried about. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh my god! Oh, we've lost our weapon. We've lost our weapon. Sawblaze is the one robot we cannot beat. Oh, that's a shame. Wait. Oh no, Sawblaze still goes! Ah! Okay. No, okay. Oh, that's a shame. We do I don't have a good way of dealing with Sawblaze here. Uh, no, okay. That didn't work. The way we can get them from behind. We are incredibly fast, so, I mean, there is a chance. Nope, okay, I can't get around them. I can't get around them. Nope, nope, nope. And that's a problem. Okay. All right, I think I'll tap out here because Sawblaze clearly has us beat. So that's one robot that's beaten us. Right, quick bonus fight. Let's see if we can take on a Robo Games champion in Manta. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. Whoa. Look at that. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Okay. And look at that. Oh, man. Our weapon is slightly unbalanced, though. That's the thing. Manta might be able to out-endure us. Although... Oh my god, what a shot. And again. Okay. Going in. Oh my god. Okay. Going in for more. Oh, gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Come on. I am so close here. Manta's so nearly dead, but they still... Have so much a weapon. This is the close. Oh no! Oh, all our weapon is gone. Oh my god. That had to have been one of the closest fights. Oh, unfortunately, again, we're gonna have to tap out. Oh man. We finally found robots that can beat us. We could have won as well, which is the worst bit. Oh, well. All right, here we go. Robot Wars time. Let's see if we can beat Apollo first. All right, okay, okay. Uh, whoa, there we go. And, ah, oh, this should be easy. Once we get those wheels, it's all over. Oh. Okay, we took out a little bit of Apollo already. Apollo is sending us sky high here. Oh, oh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, it's fine. There we go. And that's one wheel of theirs already gone. Just gotta go in and get that other wheel now. Okay. Come on. There we go. Oh! And... Oh, that's them stuck. Well, there we go. That's another win there. Nice. Well, let's move on to Carbide. <coughs> All right, this one should be tricky, but we might be able to do it. Bring it on, Carbide. Okay. 
because their wheels are very exposed, but their weapon is also stupidly powerful, so we run the risk of our weapon breaking again. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God, they're destroying us. I can't control myself. Oh, my God, I'm so unbalanced. It's actually really hard to drive. Okay, got to keep on them. Oh, my God, I'm struggling here. Okay. Oh, Carbide is... Okay, Carbide's okay. We're okay. We can still keep fighting. There we go. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! That was definitely up there with, like, Sawblaze and Manta in terms of difficulty. But we managed to do it. Carbide is out! Oh my god. Well, let's move on, shall we? Alright, here we go. All right, Eruption, the last ever Robot Wars champion. Oh, it's such a shame the reboot got cancelled. I will forever argue we, that Robot Wars should come back. Oh, man. Oh, got to be careful. Got to be careful. Can't get make a mistake because Eruption could, you know, still throw us out. There we go. There we go. And hey! That's another win in the books. And that's another challenge in the books. Well, while I do the outro, I'm going to beat some classic uh, BattleBots champions. But yeah, I want to thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, then please be sure to leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And hit that notification bell to be notified of future videos on the channel. I'm doing, I do new challenges each and every week, between two to three challenges each and every week on average. Um, you know, if you want to leave a challenge down in the comment section down below, feel free. I try to get to as many as I can. Um, and if you leave a comment, there's a chance I may do your challenge next. Oh, man. Sorry, Sidaway Archie. Oh, man. Oh, this is brutal. Oh, Sidaway Archie. I'm so sorry. If you could share this video around with your friends, that would also be super appreciated. You know, leaving a like and sharing the video around helps to get more eyes on the channel, which helps me out immensely. And of course, if you, you know, if you're not already aware, I now have memberships, which for a small fee, you get access to custom emotes, for, you know, which is great for leaving on YouTube comments and to use during my streams, which I'm trying to do more often. Um, oh, gosh. Um, there's a really fun game that I want to try out for streams and, you know, obviously lots of requests I've been getting for games to stream. Um, oh gosh, there we go, there we go. Um, and of course, sometimes you get bonus videos. I try to, like, make a bonus challenge every week and, and I'm hoping to have, like, bonus content for when I do reviews, you know. So it should be a fun time, really. It should be a fun time and I'm looking forward to, uh, you know, oh gosh to what's to come. Of course, you don't have to do any of that, but any support you give, no matter what, is always super, super appreciated. Thank you all so much for the continued support on the channel. Thank you so much. Let's just get this out of the way. Come on. Come on, Brutality. Come on, Brutality. I want to put this video away. There we go. All right, Perfect Phoenix, it's you and me now. Come on. Come here, Perfect Phoenix. There we go. Oh. Oh, that's ruthless. Oh, gosh. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you all next time. I'm just going to finish off Perfect Phoenix here. Um, but for everyone else, bye, guys. Come on, Perfect Phoenix. Oh, we are not done by a long shot. Come here. Oh, gosh. Did I take out another one of their wheels? I think I did. Yeah, they've only got two-wheel drive now. Okay, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. And there we go. Oh, well, I, I, I mean, Vlad would have been even easier to beat than the rest, so I think we could end it there. Bye, everyone.